Hi, I'm Scotty. Welcome to Scotty's Clock World. First, we'll take off the suspension spring and the pallets. Do that little arm. Wind it out of the road. That arm there. Lift the suspension spring very gently. Don't want to break it. Well, this got full of oil too. It's come out. Now take the pallets off. Put that into the going train box. Right, now we'll loosen some nuts that hold the plate together. I'll see if I've got a big enough I don't think it is not nope. nope. have to use my little shift loose them up a bit Seriously covered in oil. The center one. One's a bit tight. I think it's some time since this movement was last worked on. Loosen these top two. As always, remember there might be a little bit of tension from the springs running up through the trains. So we'll lift that out of the road. We'll lift the top plate off very slowly. We don't want wheels jumping out all over the floor. Take these nuts off. They are tight, gee. That's a bit better. Yuck oil everywhere. Okay. Now very carefully lift the top plate by pushing against the posts. Up to the top. Then lift the plate off. You can see all the gunk and oil that's built up on all those bushes, both sides of the plate. I reckon we've got some rebushing to do there. Escape wheel goes in the going side train. Now we'll take the rest of it to pieces. Where's my. There we go. First up, I'll put this wheel back where it belongs. So we can see what it looks like 
when we put it all back together again. See where the springs are. These little bits of wire here, put a bit of tension. There and there. On those levers. Right. I'll grab a photo of that. Then we'll be ready to roll. We'll take the motion works out first. Put that aside. And the going train. Third wheel. Second wheel. First wheel. And the hammer. Now the two levers. First up the lift lever. From there, take the fly out. The J hook. Both those fine brass springs wind around that post there in a clockwise movement to keep a little bit of pressure on the spring uh, keep a little bit of pressure on the levers okay Oop. here we go we're down to the springs which will take off so we can put the, the big the main wheel into the ultrasonic and grief Strike side wheel. Look at the oil that's run off in my gloves. From there, 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 all the way around the bottom of that pillar. I'll have to wipe that down before it goes in the ultrasonic. Now we need to know what size the pivot is on this wheel. 1.63 mil. This is the rack hook right here. That 